Legend. I'm Casargenia, and today we're playing more Monster Hunter 3 Ultimate. Demo version, of course. And today we're using the Hammer Glass. A close quarter weapon with immense damage potential. Charge up attacks and stun monsters by crushing their skulls. So, yeah. Looks like we're playing as a lady again. So that makes three out of the five classes we've played thus far being ladies. Okay, 20 minutes. Alright. Let's eat. Grab. Oh, we have dash juice, huh? Wonder what that did. Or does. Anyway, um. Looks like we're. It. Honestly, I don't anticipate this class to be very fun. It seems to me like it'd be slower than the. Slower than the Great Sword class. But. The hammer doesn't exactly look as bulky as the uh, as the great sword. So who knows? I may end up enjoying the class. Screw you! Wow. I think that was like a one shot on that guy. So we've got some power, and it didn't take very long to swing that. There it is. Oh no, nope, it's Sami. All right, buddy. You want to inspect us? Go on ahead. Okay, he's decided we're hostile. Now's the time to bring it on. Okay, so this appears to be like demon mode for the hammer. Thanks, guys, except I'd kind of appreciate it if you could stop him from sliding around so much. Let's get him. Oh, that's cool. And we get knocked over. I guess at this point, ooh, she has nice dodging abilities too. Let's see if we can get him. Okay, he missed. Now's the time to whack his butt and face. Ow. And that was an accidental lock skirt. Great. Never mind what I said about Capcom and not objectifying women in this game. I'm not trying to be a butthurt fanboy or anything, but honestly, do you really think 13 year olds need to see this kind of stuff? For that matter, do you think that, for that matter, do you think 24 year olds need to see this stuff outside the bedroom? Oh, it just kind of engages automatically if we run out of stamina. It kind of sucks that it runs on stamina, but I guess that's why they gave us the dash juice. Okay, we successfully dodged that. And let's kick some buns. Missed. Missed again. Because I suck that way. Got him. And he does his cheap attack on me. One. Two. And he runs away. Let's wait him out. Okay, he stopped moving. Let's go. Let's charge it up. And get knocked over. And slide on our button. This, you know what would be really weird? If someone was born with only one, like, butt cheek. Like, I know it's a weird thing to talk about while I'm hunting this guy, but what if someone was only born with one butt cheek? I once read this article about a little baby who had two, um shall we say, planks, instead of the one. One of them was actually on his back, which is really weird. Really weird. Birth... wonder... wonder what caused that, like, maybe his mom, or did something? I don't know. Um, I don't really know what to talk about here now. Except, if he'd stop attacking us, I should probably heal. Okay, he's focused on them. Let's heal up. What's he doing? Is he fighting Kayamba? Dude, you shouldn't even waste your time with that one. It's kinda pointless. He's weak. Far too easy of a, of a prey. Okay, we got some good hits on him and managed to dodge his snowball attack. Not gonna lie, still a little worried since this is still my first time playing as this particular class, but I'm kinda liking it. 
She's a little slow, but she's not like as slow as the great sword. She's not molasses slow. Wow, I actually dodged that. And that has insane reach. Dodge out of the way. Miss again. Ow. Stop looking up my skirt. We all know you were doing it, you pervert. So knock it off. We don't need we don't need you to pull a Parker, dude. And that's my mobile phone. Oh. I should probably take this soon. Uh see ya, guys. Sorry about that, guys. Uh that was actually my mother. And I think that's twice now she's interrupted the series. But she's gonna be coming over for a little while to check the place out and such. Yeah, she still hasn't been over and I moved out just under a year ago, actually. I really try to keep to myself when it comes to that kind of stuff. But, uh, she's gonna be here soon. Uh, I don't know. I haven't really seen a lot of traffic today. Normally it takes about 15 minutes to get here with bad traffic, so who knows. Maybe she... I don't know when she's gonna come over, actually. Get out of here. Get out of here. Did I just engage, engage rage mode on the parent? I sure hope not. And he ran again. Great. Let's keep going. There he is. Alright guys, I'm Let's back get, again, get, 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 and get, get, this time, get, get, get. it was because my camera's battery died, and uh, that's the issue with my camera. It doesn't really say when it's about to die, so we're getting some good hits on this here, but for you guys, this little that little cut in the commentary and footage there shouldn't really be much of an issue, because, well, for you guys, it was probably only a couple seconds between that footage in this footage. For me, it was about 30 minutes while I waited for my batteries to charge. So, yeah, I don't really know what else to say. Except he went there. He really did that. I can't believe his nerve. I cannot believe the balls that this guy has. I mean, to hit a girl, and for that matter, a kind of... Actually, I don't know where I'm going with this, but to hit a girl, and to run her over, and then look up her skirt. This guy has balls. Yeah, I don't know what ones. I walked right into that, didn't I? Well, I guess we just keep wailing away on him. Getting, getting some good hits off on him, which is nice. Canceled an attack out. And, uh, I've been recording this for quite a bit, so I think after this episode I'm gonna take a break and go to sleep. Although, what really sucks is that we lost some sharpness on our weapon. Although I don't really understand how weapons, I mean, how hammers can be sharp. So, yeah. This game, it's video game logic. It doesn't have to make sense for it to work. Oops, sorry, Kayamba. Ah, missed. Whoop. Nope, no thanks. I don't really like your ice chunks all that much. And you clearly don't like my hammer. But frankly, it's human will against animal will, and I'm pretty sure human will wins. Since us humans have weapons to fight you guys with, well, all you guys really have is your own kind of fists, unless you're a primate, where you can then make small tools, small semi-useful tools out of whatever materials you can find. Oops. Okay, that has a lot of range. Way too much range. Oh, uh, no. Why did he have to trip there? 
because by the time I get to him, he's already up and running again. He ran off again and tripped again, super far away from us. Ten minutes. Uh oh, we need to get going. Although this guy is taking a lot more breaks and he's falling over a lot more, so we're definitely getting some key hits on him. A lot of damage done. So I guess while this thing doesn't exactly have a lot of sharpness, it's still got a lot of raw power behind it, which is good. You know, when I first started playing this class, I thought she was going to be, like, as heavy as the Greatsword class. And Greatsword class is a great class, just, uh, it's not my kind of class. Let's try to blow him. Oh, it worked. Except we kind of blew ourselves up too, and it wasn't fatal. But she's a bit more lightweight than the great sword, actually. And I really like playing as this class. Probably one of my favorites. Not necessarily a super duper favorite like the dual blades, but it's probably one of the classes I'd play a bit more often, rather than like. The long sword or something, which is also kind of fun, but at the same time, it's not something I'd play very often. But I'd play it more often than the great sword. Let's just sharpen our thing and get snowballed in the process. Kayamba, save me. Thank you. Now's our chance. Sharpen, 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 sharpen. There we go. Sharpness at maximum again, huh? Alright. Oh hey, he didn't slip this time. Ow. Kinda walked into that one, didn't I? Oh man, I thought I could knock him over again. Oh well, shouldn't be too difficult. Nope. Ow. Whoa. No thank you. Aw, oh, dang it, I thought I could just walk out of the way. Well... You just try your best, and if people don't like you for trying your best, so be it. Whoa. Actually, that wasn't even close to me. I have no right to say whoa well there. I, I swear those guys are in perfect, or almost perfect sync. Kayamba goes back into cryostasis. Cha-Cha comes out. I wonder if they're the same person. Although, oh wow, I missed both of those. But, uh, I'm actually starting to lose some stamina. Ow. When this guy runs away again, I may need to restore that. Okay, good, he missed. Because that may have very well screwed me. Oh. Oh gosh, I can't take another hit. Run away! Heal up. Now is the time to heal up when he's roaring at us. Yes, please keep roaring so I can heal up. Oh wow, completely missed him. I need to learn to aim. So let's restore our stamina real fast while he's distracted. There we go. Ow, again. Although we're wielding a fairly heavy weapon, I'm surprised by how easily we still get knocked around. I mean, I get that most heavy weapons have some way of blocking and this one doesn't, but still, you think that carrying that thing around would at least add a little weight to us so we don't get knocked around so easily. But then again, we are a girl, and girls don't really have as much muscle as guys, so naturally they don't weigh as much naturally. Am I making sense? Am I using too much natural? Am I using the word naturally too much? Because it's perfectly natural that I naturally cancel out his perfectly natural attacks using his natural abilities with my unnaturally made hammer. Okay, I think I've used naturally enough for one day. And I don't know what else to say now. Except I just kind of rhymed there and canceled out an attack of his again. Oh, didn't cancel it this time, but... Oh, I almost had him. But we are getting some good hit... Missed him. Getting some good hits on him. Oh, no thank you. We don't... It seems like he's, like, in the phase where he'd start running, like, limping away from us, but 
he doesn't seem to be doing that. Yeah, he's running off. We should probably just put away the hammer and give chase. Five minutes. Oh no, we don't have time for this. We gotta move now. Go, 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 go. Didn't make it very far. There we go. Getting some hits on him. Let's use the bombs. And we'll use the dash juice too. Just so we can keep chase. Keep the chase going. One, two. There we go. Got some damage on him. Now just keep wailing. Missed. There we go. Knocked him over. Now we just keep. Let's charge up. There we go. And. Got some hits. Okay, he fell over again. Shouldn't be long now. Shouldn't be long. Yep, we got him on the run. Missed. Dang it. Nope. Dang it. Come on, come on, we can make it. Just charge. Go. Run. Charge. Flank him. Dang it. Okay. He's behind us. And he's weakened. We need to finish him off. He can't have much more health. And I know I've been saying that for a while, but... We need to finish him. While he's down. A well-placed bar large barrel bomb would do the trick, except I kind of used that already. Because I underestimated the power of the hammer. On the right side, though, our... Uh, our... <gasps> Sorry about that, got a little bit of the hiccups. Oh, just as I say it, our sharpness decreased. Doesn't seem like this thing has very good sharpness, and that has a lot of range. But one good thing is... Not that he was kind of juggling me on his back there, but that our dash juice hasn't run out yet. Of course, now it's going to start running out. Okay, we knocked him over again. At this point, we just keep wailing. He can't have much more health. I know he can't. Yep, he's on the run again. This is going to be where we finish him. Let's cut him off. Yeah. Yes. Yes! And that finishes him. That was a good hunt, I'll admit it. So, thanks for watching. I'm Cathogenia, signing off. See you all in the next video.